or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And I would love it if you would consider subscribing. And if you subscribe, hit that notification bell and set it to all so you won't miss an upload. And to my returning subscribers, you know I love you so much. What we're going to be doing today is I want to decorate my farmhouse hutch that I redid in our last video. You can see I already have the top decorated and we're gonna be decorating the rest of it. But before we go on, I want to announce the winner of the $300 Hobby Lobby gift card. I'm so excited for you. Now, if you did not win, don't feel sad. There'll be plenty more opportunities going forward on my channel for giveaways. So, the winner of the $300 Hobby Lobby gift card is Darlene Mullins. Darlene, I'm so happy for you. Now, all you need to do is just email me and I'll put my email address right here and in the description box below the video, uh, your address, and I will mail this right out to you. So congratulations, Darlene Mullins, on winning this $300 gift card. I'm so excited and I wish I could have given everyone a, uh, a $300 gift card, but that's not possible. But like I said, don't feel sad. There'll be plenty giveaways going forward and opportunities for you to win. Okay, so let's go ahead and style this farmhouse hutch. Now I'll show this better to you later, but I've gone ahead and I've put some greenery there and there that I had, and then that's a DIY that I did, and I'll link everything that I can find that I used to style my hatch if I can find it, or my videos that I've made in the description box below. Then I've had those for a long time. I got those baskets at Walmart years ago, and I love them. And then that came from Michael's a long time ago. But like I said, that's a DIY. So let's get started with this farmhouse decorate with me my hutch for 2022. Okay, the first little item I'm going to be using on this farmhouse hutch is this adorable sign. I picked it up at Walmart, I think it was last fall, and I only paid $6.98 for it. It's metal and it just says historic farmer's market. Don't you love that rooster? I do, okay? And I'm just going to put it right up here in the center and just lean it, okay? And you can either tuck that uh, little string behind it or leave it out. I'm not sure what I'm going to do just yet, okay? Then the next thing I'm going to be adding is this little cloche. You get a set of two cloches on Amazon. Like I said, I'll link everything just in case you're interested. And these candles, now these candles you get, I think it's like seven or eight, I really don't remember. Got them on Amazon. They come with, I think it's two remotes and with timers and different things like that. And they're heat resistant, so I like that. Sometimes I use them outside. So that's what I'm going to put right here. You can, one, the other lantern is just a little bit taller than that one. Now, most of this I've had, but I did pick up a few new things from Target. Oh my gosh, the Hearth and Hand, Studio McGee, the Dollar Spot, everything is just ugh, unbelievable. But look at this, $5. Look at this adorable little plant. I love it, okay? You could put it in a different pot if you wanted. You could paint this pot, but I like it like it is. So I'm just going to stick it right here. And I'm loving that so far, okay? Okay, my next three finds are from Walmart. The same time I bought that big sign, I bought um, these three plates. So I think it was last fall, but here is the first one. And it just says morning coffee. They were $5.98 and they are glass, but I love how farmhouse they look. They just lend to a beautiful farmhouse look. Then I think this one is my favorite. Look at that little pig. 
sunshine sweet ham. <laughs> And then this little chick, I think it is adorable. Okay, so simple, so farmhouse looking. Okay, the next couple things are from Target as well. These were $5 for two. Look at that. Look how beautiful, sorry about that ring light glare. You get two of them. I just love it. And I'm going to put these right here and just stack them. I think that just adds such farmhouse flair. So, you know me, I had to pick the blue and white up too. These are so adorable. And um, let's see. Stoneware, dishwasher safe, microwave safe, but it says it might get hot in the microwave. I mean, you can use these for so much. And I love how it plays with all the colors in there. I just love it. And I picked up the pink, love this. I got every one, but they had a white that had some flowers and my target didn't have it. I'm gonna to try to find them though, but these are by threshold, love them, okay? So I'm gonna put this, I think, right here. I think. Then I picked up this little planet target, so adorable, $4.99, can you believe it? And it's just a mini plant. You could paint this, I love it just like it is. I think I'm going to put this right here. I think like that. Then I'm getting out my little picture that I hauled recently from Hobby Lobby. $7.99, but 50% off. I'm going to go back and try to get some more of these little beauties. Loving this, okay? Then, Target once again, I think this was $5. Can you believe it? Gorgeous and very large. So I'm just putting this in. I've had this from Target a long time. I think it was hearth and hand. I'm just going to put that in there and set that right in there. And then prop that little lid up. It just looks so cozy. Then I've had this from Hobby Lobby a long time. It looks like rosemary to me. I'm going to set it right here, I think. And then this I picked up at Hobby Lobby a long time ago. Isn't it gorgeous? Looks like it belongs right here in this little farmhouse area. Okay, and then the last thing I'm going to add, I picked this up, this basket at Walmart last, I think it was summer uh, and I love it and then I'm going to put this little chicken from Hobby Lobby always get it when it's 40% off and then I just have a wreath in here with a little bit of um, raffia down in there and it's gorgeous let's take a closer look but I'm loving this. Now, um, I'm going to be going to get some more little things so I can change it up just a little bit. But this is what I had on hand and I absolutely love it. Okay, we'll start up there. I just love how that looks. That wicker baskets, it really warms the area up. And then I love that galvanized tin. And then that was just, a milk can, not a milk can, that was just a paint can that I picked up. It was plain, got it at Lowe's for a little bit of nothing in their paint section, and I embellished it with molds and paint, and then I just stuck some greenery in there. And then right here is that greenery cascading down, and then just look. So farmhouse, so perfect. I'm loving it. 
And I love that green against that green. I debated whether to put this over here because it's kind of tall and you can't see that plate, but I really kind of like the symmetry. I'm so, I'm such into symmetry, small, short, short, tall. So I don't know, might change it later. Then there is that. Then we'll come down here and here is this, so adorable. Okay, that's how it's looking. I think it looks like it belongs right in an adorable little farmhouse. Okay, that's how that looks. Then if you come over here, I thought I'd just give you a really quick little glance. Um, right now, I had pictures there, a picture, but I took it down because it. I want to get something else and I may get something else to go right here. So that's why that looks a little bare, but right in here for now, I think I'm going to add some fairy lights into my lantern. Um, I just have my little brick mold that I love. And then these flameless candles and I just put some greenery in that lantern kept it really simple think i might add fairy lights and then that's one of my farmhouse little diys i made think it is adorable i don't know if i'm going to change this corner up i may depending on what i put on the walls okay but i wanted to give you a little glimpse of that So let me say once again, congratulations, Diane Mullins. You're the winner of the $300 Hobby Lobby gift card. I'm so excited for you and all the shopping you get to do at Hobby Lobby. If you didn't win, like I've said, don't feel sad. There'll be plenty more opportunities going forward for giveaways. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It really helps me out on YouTube. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, I would love it if you would subscribe and become a member of our family. And if you subscribe, hit that notification bell and set it to all so you won't miss an upload. So I will see you Tuesday. And I'm not sure what we're going to be doing. Where I worked on that hutch so much, um, I had to sleep with my brace on my thumb and switch off on my middle fingers because that trigger finger is really angry again. Um, I want to do some Valentine DIYs, but I might try to do a decorate with me in the kitchen or uh, I have some things I found at Target. I may, uh, like I said, the hearth and hand and Studio McGee and all that, unbelievable and they won't last. So I may do that on Tuesday. We will just see. So let me go get Maggie and let her say hi to you. Well, here is the baby, and she was sleeping on the couch. Maggie, were you sleeping? Yes, she was sleeping. And she said, I grumbled a bit at Mom. I said, I'm so tired. Say, when we went to get up this morning, say, I crawled back under my covers, didn't you? Did you crawl back in your covers in bed? Yes, she did. She says, I'm tired. So, until next time, bye, guys.